And then that, George Clooney did over to him. He just nope. walked past him. And he, just but he said hello to you because, because like Tom Hanks, he's supposed to be the nicest guy in the world. Yeah, I mean, he made out. He said, "Hey, you know," which I mean, is what I, he should do. He, he, Tom Hanks, the, they have a, an awareness of their station in the world. Mm-hmm. Um, there are uh, there are those of us who do not presume that someone knows who they are <laughs> if they make eye, con- eye contact with them. Those guys have to know that it is pretty much a lock that yeah. if they make eye contact with a stranger, that stranger knows who they are. Yeah. So they, they uh, to their credit, I've met Tom Hanks a couple of times and very, very generous with, uh, you know, how are you? Hey, I'm Tom. It's like, yeah. okay. Like, <laughs> uh, you know, uh, very, very generous. And, and yes, George Clooney, uh, is didn't make eye contact and sort of break it. He just said, "Hey, hey!" Just back. kept moving. Yeah, with his salt and pepper hair. My God, I'm telling you. I know, dude. I saw him backstage at the U2 concert, and it was he was standing right behind me. And and uh, Ackerman is like, he's right behind you. He's right, behind you. <laughs> right behind you. He's right behind you. And it was like, well, why don't why why don't I get to look at him? <laughs> why 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 do you get to have that view? <laughs> and uh, then we kind of did a, a rotating, and then I got to. Oh yeah. Oh boy. Man, my God! I had a, uh, I was so speaking. Okay, this is this is a little bit, uh, whatever. I'm at SNL, so I'm visiting Night. SNL Saturday Night Live. I'm, and I'm watching from the writers' room. I was there. It was back when Bobby Moynihan was on the show, and and I could go see the show, you know, whenever. And uh, musical guest is Beyonce Knowles, um, a very beautiful woman in her own right. At one point, she walked past me in the hall. She said, hi. I was like, fuck off. You're, <laughs> you're stunning. So I go, uh, when you're watching in the writer's room at SNL, they usually will clear it out that everybody comes downstairs for the musical guest. And they all go uh, oh. from the writer's room and stand, sort of become the audience right in front of the musical guest. Uh, it's just to the, like, if you're looking at it, it's just to the left of where the monologue happens. And I'm standing there, and I'm, she's singing Single Ladies. Right, so I'm just already, I mean, she's the sexiest person on the planet as far as I'm concerned. I am fixed on her uh, until I notice the gentleman directly to my right who's sort of nodding along, baseball cap, and I look, and uh, Leonardo DiCaprio is standing directly <laughs> to my right, and I was like, what the fuck is that? <laughs> I just, I felt like the, a toad, <laughs> yeah, the, the most hideous thing yes. on the, in the world. Just uh, too much beauty in one place. He's a yeah. handsome man. A very handsome man. Agreed. Very handsome. Uh, that's a good, I, I agree with you. You know, when I was in Dreamgirls, and Beyonce <laughs> and I uh, were on set, we discussed a lot of things. <laughs> To hear the whole conversation, subscribe for free on Apple Podcasts or wherever you get your podcasts, or visit NeverNotFunny.com.